Michael Jordan once said, sometimes things may not go your way, but the effort should be there every single night. Welcome to McBain Moments. Uh, before I get into this topic, please make sure that you take a moment and subscribe to the channel, please. We are on the road to 13 million subscribers. We got a long way to go, so please make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. I really appreciate it. So, effort. Michael Jordan's words really struck a chord with me as I was looking at them. And a lot of the quotes I generate, I, I generate them from Brainy Quote, full disclosure. And I spend a lot of time on there with my nine to five, and this is where I find a lot of this stuff. I jot things down in a notebook. But no matter our, our best efforts, no matter how, how much work we put into something, no matter no matter the attitude that we bring to a task, sometimes things are not going to go our way. It's just a fact of life. And so, what do we do when we're faced with that situation? How do we respond to it? How do we rally and go back at it? Because it's not an easy thing to do. You know, you beat your head against the wall. So it's harder than playing Dark Souls, right? Sometimes. You know, you beat your head against the wall, you you keep trying to get something done or you're trying to accomplish something or you, you continue to work hard for an employer and the employer's only response is to basically make life harder for you. And so how do you respond to this? And and that's not an easy thing to do and I, and I struggled with this last night because it's, it's not a situation I'm dealing with but someone I know is. And what it comes down to is, is what uh, Jean-Luc Picard in Star Trek once said this to Data in one of the episodes. And it's a very, in my opinion, it's probably his most profound statement ever. You can do everything right and still lose. That doesn't mean that you've done anything wrong. It's just life, and that's a paraphrase because I know I got that quote wrong. No matter what you do, sometimes things aren't going to go our way. Sometimes things won't go your way. It's just the way things work. It's unfortunate. It's frustrating. It's anger-inducing. But them's the breaks. And so how you handle that frustration is the important part. And you can spend time being disappointed. You can spend time being angry. You can spend time being even depressed, although I would discourage you from being depressed. You know, try to find a way to prevent it from getting that far. The the point is is after the emotions subside and make an effort to to make those emotions subside, you know, kind of exist for a little while and then push the emotions and say, okay. You know, we're going to go to bed tonight, we're going to get up in the morning, and we're going to go at it again. And you just push. You redouble those efforts. You work harder. And it's not going to be easy. And sometimes it's going to hurt. But that's what you do. Because at the other end of that effort is the goal that you set for yourself. The other end of that pain is the goal you set for yourself. Pain is okay. Quitting is not. There's a... There's a need to light a fire within yourself. And when that fire burns, it doesn't matter what obstacles you come against. You will eventually go through them. But sometimes keeping that fire kindled is the hardest thing in the world, especially since the world has a nasty habit of trying to snuff those fires. Like seriously, it, it seems like... It often seems like the world's first priority is to keep us where we are. And the irony is that it is through the work that we do 
the efforts that we make and overcoming those obstacles that not only do we push ourselves higher, but the world comes with us. Because as you better yourself, you better the world around you. And so, every day, no matter what's going on, look yourself in the mirror and go, okay, here are the things that I can do today to make just a little bit of progress. And sometimes that progress is just not moving backward or not moving backward too far. <clears throat> Excuse me. There are days you're going to move two steps forward and one step back. Sometimes, occasionally, you'll end up having to take two steps back for every step forward because you'll be pushing up against resistance. But remember the words of Roger Bannister. The one who can drive themselves further once the effort gets painful is the one who will win. I'm going to repeat that. The one who can drive themselves further once the effort gets painful is the one who will win. Again, Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe this, to this video. I appreciate all the support. This has been a McBain moment.